Hey guys, welcome back to my channel. Today is Monday and I am about to head to work. I'm getting my mind right, you know. Um, it's 10.30, I actually have to be at work in 30 minutes, but I'm in the parking lot of Panera Bread. I just picked up some lunch, that way I can have later. Cause I'm getting really tired of the foods and restaurants around my job. I mean, I'm just over it. I've had like the same foods for lunch for the past four or five years that I've been working there. But um, I tried the Fuji apple salad from Panera Bread a couple weeks ago. And oh my God, I was just in love. So I couldn't get the Fuji apple salad um, out of my head. So I was like, let me pick that up so I can have it for lunch later while I'm at work. So I just did that. Um, and my mom got me a coquito yesterday from this Puerto Rican um, restaurant where I live. Um, my favorite flavors are coco and strawberry. So she got me a coco. So I'm going to start eating that now. And yeah, let me head to work. Um, I started listening to audible last night um you should download the audible app and you get a 30-day free trial and you get to pick one book for free and i chose the secret and i am addicted after i finish talking to you guys i'm actually gonna play it so i can listen to it as i drive to work oh you're gonna get but yeah i just want to kind of like oh crap i can't go that way i just want to like spiritually physically everything just reconnect with the universe I believe that if you have a positive mind positive attitude and you control your thoughts that's what you manifest but I never really um, took the steps to focus on that and I'm really trying to now so I thought the secret would be a really good book for me to listen to before I go to bed um, when I have some free time and while I'm driving to work so I'll keep you guys updated on what I think about this secret. I already love it. It's already making me tell myself today, um, you are what you think. You manifest what you think. So do not think badly or negatively because that's what you bring into your life. You are what you think. Um, so I'm just like repeating that over and over and over in my head today because I do want to make some changes, some positive ones. Have to warm up the chicken, but I wanted to show you the salad. So the Fuji apple salad has tomato, chicken, dried apples, um, I think pecans, cheese, arugula. Oh my God, just amazing things. I'm gonna warm up the chicken though. dressing is so good Perfect. I don't know if I mentioned this already but I'm at work I'm on break and I'm like in the dungeon so if it looks a little scary behind me it's because I'm in a basement <laughs> you know what I've been meaning to tell you guys um link down in the description is my Poshmark account. I'm going to be adding a lot more stuff from my closet that I no longer wear anymore or really just haven't worn at all. Um, but so far I have like some of my daughter's stuff, Gianna, stuff that doesn't fit her, stuff she's never worn with tags or stuff that she's worn only once. Um, so if you guys are interested, my Poshmark is linked down below and you can see what is in my closet. Okay, so it is five o'clock in the afternoon. It's so damn cold. I just got out of work. I should be home within I should be home within the hour. Hopefully there's not a lot of traffic. But I'll just show you guys what I do. Like a typical evening when I get home from work, what I do with dinner and Gianna and everything like that. Alright, I'll see you guys in a little. It is 5.59, I just got home. I picked up Gianna from my mother-in-law's house. 
thankfully my mother-in-law literally lives like a minute and 30 seconds away so super easy super convenient um gianna is just playing in her playroom right now i just gave layla her dog food but she's not eating it <laughs> and i'm gonna show you what's a huge lifesaver especially for mamas who work but this baby right here this is my crock pot and i got this I got my crock pot five years ago at my bridal shower um, before I got married and it is the most amazing gift that I got at my bridal shower ever because it really saves me time. Um, right now I have seasoned chicken thighs in there and you just turn it on in the morning. Usually I have like my mother-in-law or, some, or someone turn it on that way it's like perfectly timed for when we get home for dinner. Right, boo-boo? Hey, mommy. And Gianna is still wearing her bell dress. Literally, I wash it and then re-put it back on her because she lives for it. Right, G? Mm -hmm. Anyways, I have to start making rice. I also have a rice cooker, which is super easy and convenient. Mommy, so, hold on, sweetie. Mommy, Can you give me one second? Mommy, they're my cookies. Oh, no, those are mine, babe. So... So I'm going to start making rice in the rice cooker. So this is my rice cooker. Um, it's called Black & Decker. That's the brand. I Mommy. Yes. Mommy. My friend, my friend Adi got this for me, I believe, for my bridal shower. And I love it. Oh, yeah, I do want one of those. Why is Layla barking? Where is the rice? <laughs> Good job, G. Thank you so much. You're welcome. You know, I don't know where my measuring cup is, so I'm just going to measure it with my eyeballs. Go find one in your room. Don't you have a flashlight? Kind of just eyeball everything. Oh shoot, that might have been way too much salt. Oh my God, could you tell? Guys, I don't know if you could tell, but I'm red right here. Long story short, I got my eyebrows done like three, four days ago and whatever she used, the kind of wax she used, I got like, I guess an allergic reaction because I got really red and itchy there. And I started breaking out. So I did this um, Sunday Riley Sulfur UFO mask. I love that mask, but I slept with it on. And it I it doesn't look really bad right now because I have foundation on, but you could still kind of tell that I'm red right here. Oh my God, I woke up and I just had this. It just, I look crazy. Just a red patch. And you could still see it even with makeup on. So I have to do like a healing mask tonight. My husband isn't home yet. It is 6.16. I got the rice cooker going. Yeah, no, I told you. Hold on, baby. Can you hold this for a second for me? No, no, no. And our chicken is done. Oh, did I get foggy? Whoa. Oh, you want some corn and stuff until rice is done? So I have Al Alvin already recorded on here because she's obsessed with him. So I always just go to the recordings and play her some Alvin. Right, G? Oh, it's already in the mid. Let's go back. So I made some chicken nuggets for Gianna. I gave her some corn just to hold her off till I made this. So we just finished dinner and I just finished cleaning up the kitchen. It's like 7.30 at night. Ron is in the shower. And Gianna goes to bed at eight. So as soon as we indulge in this cookie, we're gonna do her night routine which is she goes to the potty before bed, we brush her teeth, 
We put her PJs on. We read a book. We say a prayer. And then she goes to bed. Ronnie's like the best ever. I always crave like peanut butter and jelly sandwiches without the crust and cut into squares just like this at night for some reason. And he makes it for me. I'm gonna make, make myself a bath. When I'm done, I'll show you my skincare that I put. Oh, it just feels so good to like be freshly out the shower or bath. I've been on this skincare regimen for a solid five months. The only thing um, I've added two products recently within the past month, um, just cause you know, as the season changes, your skin changes, you may need to take away or add products. So let me just explain my skin right now to you in case you're into this kind of stuff. Currently, I have combination skin. Since it's winter time, my cheeks right here, where it's red, and my forehead area right here, like in the center, my cheeks and my forehead gets really, really dry and really chapped. So that's one thing. And then just the rest of my face is just combination to normal. So I freaking have all the problems you could ever imagine. This past summer, in the month of July, I went through a really bad breakout. I've never had that experience my whole life. And um, so the whole summer I broke out. Thank you, Jesus, I'm not breaking out anymore. I don't know what that was all about. But now I have scars from that. So I incorporated a product recently that I only do at night that has retinol that helps with hyperpigmentation. So I'll show you. My core face skin care line is from Kat Berkey. And Kat Berkey is out of Westport, Connecticut. I've actually met Kat Berkey like twice. Her line is freaking phenomenal. Phenomenal. Um, pricey, but worth every penny. makes such a mess and it kind of fluffs up which I love so any skincare that's left I always run I mean um, I always put on the back of my hands because if you ever look at a woman's hands when they're older you can just really tell their age with their hands so always carry your skincare onto your hands ladies my ph essence over that this is step two normally if it was during the day i would have put my cat berkey vitamin c face cream but i use this as my day cream i'm going to show you what i use as my night cream this is um a prescription from from the dermatologist to help with like acne and I only use it on my forehead because usually on my forehead I get these little like bumps that are called comedones, I believe. And this really helps take care of that. Disregard this red extra redness here, guys. Um, as I said earlier, I overdid it with a mask last night that irritated my skin. This is the product that I use only at night because it has retinol in it and helps with hyperpigmentation. And I only use that one pump, um, which around my like cheek and jawline where I broke out. And I like to be very particular with this product. I don't want to waste it because this bottle is like, I forget, I think three or 400. My current, my last product is um, a line called Shawl. And this line, um, the lady who, the founder of this line, she lives in Greenwich, Connecticut. And her line is all about like gemstones and pearls and crushed diamond um, and all about like energy. 
I had the pleasure of meeting her a few times. She was such a sweetie. I go in with the Grande Lash MD Eyelash Serum. This eyelash serum I've been using since June of 2018. This, I swear by this product. And then last but not least, this isn't part of my skincare regimen, but um, I'm going to try it tonight. And this is a sample that I got from work. Vintner's Daughter. Vintner's Daughter is a facial oil slash serum. Um, the oil, the face oil, I believe is like 185. And it's very healing. Um, and gentle so I tried a little at work on this irritated spot and it felt so nice so I was like let me take a sample home and try it tonight if you're new here to my little family I appreciate you don't forget to like this video give me a thumbs up um follow me on instagram at vanessapompa91 and I'll catch you guys in the next video Bye.